If you've seen prairie dogs at all, your experience probably has been to pull to an overlook in some national park out west. This is prairie dog town. Pull out your camera, roll down your window, take a snapshot, and then move on. The next time you see prairie dogs, sit in the car for a little while. Watch them. You'll be amazed. Prairie dog towns are collections of colonies that are all grouped together. And a prairie dog town itself can be really large. The largest colony on record consisted of over 400 million prairie dogs. And that's a good reminder of how many prairie dogs there used to be in the Great Plains. We think somewhere around 4 billion. That's right, 4 billion with a B. <laughs> Today, there's only 2% of the area that prairie dogs formerly occupied still with prairie dogs. So they've declined by somewhere around 98%. And these animals aren't just colonial. These animals are highly social. The first thing you see is what they're doing right here behind me now, which is tail flicking and yipping. That little chip, chip, it's all behind me there. These animals look for predators. And when one animal sights something that could be a predator, like me, that barking starts. <laughs> <laughs> and the tail flipping. That's warning all the other family members and all the other members of the neighborhood, all the other members of the town for that matter, that there might be somebody dangerous in town. They're sophisticated vocally. They have at least nine different calls. This call will go on for quite some time. And then all of a sudden, when they stop, you'll see prairie dogs start throwing their hands up in the air and yipping. It's called a jump yip call. I like to call it the praise the Lord call because it looks like they belong at church. They're jumping out of their seats to let everybody know the coast is clear. We think that's what that particular call means. We also see that grooming and greeting is very important in prairie dogs. So when you see two prairie dogs meet out here, the first thing they'll do is kiss. Now everybody thinks that's so cute. It's not actually kissing. It's a way of letting them know who they are. But they also groom, and grooming is common in most social animals. So you'll see these prairie dogs out here grooming each other, almost like you see in primates in the zoo. It's an incredibly socially complex animal and uh, just a riot to watch. Spend some time with prairie dogs next time you see them. Bison may be important engineers of the prairie, but what could transform this into this.